Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Technically T here, and today we're going to get into another iPhone 7 Plus case review. Now, today we're going to get into the Poetic Revolution series for your iPhone 7 Plus. Now, this is a rugged, heavy-duty case, so a lot of you guys that work in these rough environments, these are one of the cases that are that's particularly for you. Before I get started, I do want to give a huge shout out to Poetic for reaching out to me once again via Twitter, asking me if I want to review one of their cases. So, huge shout out to Poetic for dropping me this case and another case that you'll see a review for to actually review on my channel. So, thanks. Huge shout out to Poetic. So, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. If you've seen or ran Poetic cases in the past, you do know the packaging is very minimalistic. No thrills, straight to the point. So, let's go ahead and jump right into it. All right. We have some, we have some typical, you know, Poetic stuff. We have an installation guide, which... This is my second time reviewing this because this case kicked my butt the first time, so I had to actually cut the camera off and do it again. Super frustrating, but if I would have read direction in the first place, I probably would have been, been fine. Thank you for your purchase and a 10% off coupon. So, let's get straight into the case. So, looking around, this is a two-part case. We have your hard back and we have your front piece with a built-in plastic screen protector. So, looking around the case, we do have your raised power button there. Go to the bottom side, we do have a cutout for your speakers and as well as a flap for your lightning cable. Flip it over to the left side, we do have the volume up, down, cutout for your mute toggle switch, top is completely closed. Flip it over to the back, we have a cutout for your camera and flash. We have some poetic branding in the middle, down here at the bottom with that revolution design with the matte black and the shiny black material. Now, flipping over to the sides, we do have uh, a textured material that's on the corners, and I think that'll help for, help for grip and also gives it a more rugged type look. And we also have some, some little styling here and there and, you know, down here as well, all for strictly looks. So, let's go ahead and get into the case and see if we can actually put it on the phone. Now, like I said, this is part two of me doing this, so I hope I don't mess up on the camera this time because if so, I just... These cases is a lot of work taking in and out. So, but once again, this is a two-part case. Like I said, hard black TPU plastic. We have some poetic information on the inside, and we also have that you know signature poetic branding logo in inside the case. This case, like I said, built-in plastic screen protector. Now I don't know if you guys are into these, but me personally, I really I think I'm gonna really like this case. And as soon as I get done review, I'm probably gonna pop this right out. And use the tempered glass that's already on it. Because I know, like most of the time, these cases have a faint gap between the screen and actually this case, this plastic on the front. So we're going to actually see if that's true. So let's go ahead and throw the phone in it. So what you're going to do is put the phone on this side first. Once again, I learned the hard way. And then we're going to slide it in this way. Now, hopefully, I don't turn the phone on like I did last time because I'm probably going to start getting a whole bunch of notifications. And that's going to be so frustrating. So let's see if we can do it. And you just work your way around the sides, like you know, your, you know, like these typical heavy duty cases, your out of boxes or whatever case. You gotta just take your time, work your way around it. Cause once it's on, it's on. It's not a whole bunch of taking on and off when it comes to these cases. When it is on, it is meant to stay on. And that's why I would have a hard time running these cases. Cause doing these reviews, I have to continuously take phone, you know, take cases on and off, on and off, on and off. This would be a hard one to do, but I think I'm gonna really like it, cause I could already see the feel of it already. All right, so let's take some of these fingerprints off. I think I got it completely on without any size being lifted up. I think we are completely on all the way around. So feels great. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump into it. Once again, raise power button, nice and tactile. You can't even tell you're using the heavy duty case. A lot of time when you're using heavy duty cases, you press those buttons, they're so hard and, and, and mushy, very tactile. That's what I expect from Poetic. Flip over to that bottom, those cutouts for your speakers pre-recessed in there, so you're pretty good. And we also have a cutout, I mean, excuse me, the flap for that lightning cable. And this is very stiff. I'm assuming this will wear in over time, but it's a very stiff, which is actually good because once it's in there, it's not, it's, it's in there, it's not coming out. Volume up and down buttons, super tactile once again. Feels amazing. Your mute toggle, uh, it's not too deep in there, just enough to maybe, you know, aggravate you, but... Uh, you might have to work a little bit to get to that mute toggle, but it's not horrible. Flip it over to the back. 
Of course, this is a heavy duty case, so you do have that camera protection, so you're good there in that category. Um, let's go, it's a heavy duty case. We really can't do a, a, a fit test. So when you're doing heavy duty cases, my main two cases, my main two points when I come to a case review is out the question. With lay on the table design, of course this has a good lay on the table design. You have a full lip here, very recessed in there. And like I said, this is a blastic screen protector on top of it. And the fit, of course, this, I mean, this is no creaking. This thing is quality made. I mean, I don't feel a creak. I don't feel a thing on this case. So that's 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 great. Before I get that, once again, let's go over what I said about the, the, the plastic screen protectors and seeing if there is a gap between the actual screen and the actual phone. So if you look at it, I'm going to try to get a good angle. It is a faint gap. If you can see it there, you can see it pretty good there. There is a faint gap. So that's going to be very frustrating when using this phone because you got to, you hear that? Kind of hard when using these when using these cases when they have that, that built-in screen protector. So that's kind of tough. I forgot to touch down here on the Touch ID. Touch ID sensor is cut out, has a nice little cutout. Feels pretty good if you're ready for that Touch ID sensor. So... Overall, this is a great feeling case. I, it's not even bulky. I mean, it's comparing it to what I use every day, which is a, a Parallax series case right here. I mean, you take you take a look at it. It's not even. It's a little more bulky, but I mean, it's it's not horrible. I mean, for a heavy duty case, this actually feels very good. Now, like I told you guys, if you want to, the review is basically over. But if you want to stick in to show you how I use this case. You can, you can hold on to it, and I actually pop the plastic off. But I may just do that off the camera. So let's go ahead and stay with the case. This is a great filling case. Great heavy-duty case. Once again, guys, when this case is on, it's not meant to be taken on and off. This case is meant to stay on and be on and not come off every day. This case is going to run with you. This case is what it's going to be. So if you guys like swapping cases, this case may not be for you because it's going to require some work taking it on and off. But if you do want an alternative to your out of box case, you know, whatever heavy duty style you're speaking, your tough armors, your, your whatever heavy duty case from these top manufacturers, this may be one of my favorites so far. I, I've used, I've held the out of box case for the seven plus. I haven't reviewed it yet, but I have had it and it's this. I like this way better because it's thin, doesn't creak, it's solid made. So once again, guys, this is the Poetic Revolution Series case for your iPhone 7 Plus. The price point is $9.95. Now for this type of protection, you cannot beat it compared to Autobox that wants to charge $50 for a computer. I just don't know how those guys do it. I don't know why they keep charging these out these outrageous prices when you got someone like poetic make it almost a better series case better quality in my opinion for 9.95 you just can't beat it i'm sorry i think you know poetic really hits it on the hand with their price points and not trying to hit anybody over the head so huge shot to poetic so once again guys this is the revolution series case for the seven plus i will drop that link down in the description and as always guys Give this video a thumbs up if you like it, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will catch you next time. Later.